Hi guys, thanks for um, clicking on this video. Today I'm going to show you my trading 212 portfolios. So let's get straight into it. So I started investing a week ago, last Friday. I'm not too sure of the date, but I will put that in the video. So this is my ISA portfolio and I will get into the difference in a different video or maybe in this video, but just not right now. So, yep, this is my ISA. I've currently invested 160 pounds in, well, 159 and 22 pence. My return is 16 pound 44, which is 10.33%, which I'm actually happy with. The line at the moment is um, flat because the market's closed. But that's been the growth over the week, which I'm really happy about. So these are my investments for the ISA. And this is my allocation at the bottom here. So I have 11 investments. So I'll just show you around. <laughs> BP, I have four shares. So this line here, I don't know if you can see it, but it's just above 307 and 50. That's the line that I bought at. So my average price is three pound nine pence. Um, and as you can see, if you've got a piece for it, that's pence. So it's three pound 62 at the moment. So it's this grown, which is great. I'm up by two pound 14 pence or 17.33 percent so i've got four shares in bp um you can set price alerts here so 305 so if it ever drops back down i'd um buy more shares and then we've got the company details which is great it tells you the ceo employees and all the rest of it all the good stuff down here key ratios which is great PE ratio, which is really important when analysing a company. You've got your dividend yield, earnings per share. You've got financial summaries, income statements, balance sheets. A lot of information here, guys, so I take full advantage. As you can see, the market's closed. It does tell you when it opens back up, which is really handy as well. I'm not going to go into the reasons why I've purchased these shares. I'll leave that for a different video. Um, this is literally just to show you guys around, get familiar with the app. So, a great thing is, if you can't afford full shares, on Trading212 you can buy fractions of a share. So, for example, Coca-Cola. Uh, the average price is, when I bought it was 37.53 a share and I didn't want to put that much money into it so I bought 0.15 of a share for £5.81 well that's what it is now not great at maths but yeah so that's pretty cool so you can get in on a company even if you don't want to have a whole share you can still get dividends from those companies you can change the chart here, so that's over a day, but market's closed, so bear that in mind. A week, that's it over a month, three months, a year, uh, max. So dare I say, this is the start of coronavirus, you can see, if you look at the date, this is March, and it suddenly took that drop, so we're recovering now. On most stocks that you see I have got American stocks and I've also got UK stocks these here the vanguards these are ETFs so I'll get into that to be fair in a, another video but they're slightly different from the individual stocks that you see me buy there's another ETF
if I take you to my invest ISA which is doing great I'm really happy with I've got lot um, less stocks in this one because actually I made it by mistake when I first started out um, which I will explain when I go into the difference between ISAs and in invest accounts but these are mostly American companies but these are big companies as are most of what I've invested in. So we've got AT and T, half a share, Carnival, five shares, Delta Airlines, a share. Powerhouse Energy is an interesting one to be fair. They've only just started out. A little bit of a risk with this one. I'm not a fan of risk, but forward to see where that one goes and it is rising so Royal Bank of Scotland 20 shares uh, Walt Disney 0 0.871 I'm really excited to get to a share on that um, as you can see I'm in the green for all of them which is great uh, the biggest earners at the moment Carnival and Delta Carnival uh, cruise company Delta Airlines it speaks for itself so it makes sense why they're the biggest earners at the moment. I'd love to get more shares in them both. 37.61% up on Carnival and 34.1% up on Delta, which is great. Six investments and I'm up £40, uh, which is 20.8%. So, yeah, amazing. Really happy. Wish I had a few grand to put in, but got to start somewhere. Um, so that's it for now, guys. I, that's just the graphs again. If you found this video helpful at all, um, give it a, give it a like, uh, subscribe to this channel and uh, hopefully I can put more videos out for you guys that you find helpful. Um, I've got a free share link as well that I will post down below so we can both get a free share if you decide to join this platform. And I've also got one for Free Trade, which is a UK platform. It's very similar to this. So, um, yeah, guys, good luck. And start your investment journey now because it's the best time to do so. Um, this is my watch list. So when you go in straight away, these are the shares that I'm watching. Uh, fractional shares, popular, US stocks, UK stocks, tech, financials. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of things up there, so just have a look around. But to get to your stocks, you just click on that buy chart at the bottom. This is where everything is. You can search for stocks by using the magnifying glass. And yeah, any questions, guys, just um, leave a comment and I will get back to you. Thanks for watching.